for another edition of the Sunday Showdown. I want to start out by saying thanks to the Sylvia Kid. Hey, thanks, man, for giving me this opportunity. All right, guys, after a couple of weeks, you've gotten to see a couple of my videos, but that's not the majority of what I do. What I do is I focus on trying to make you better at Modern Warfare 3. All right, guys, on my channel, you're going to find spawn location maps with callouts for, I think, I have 19 maps done so far. And at the top of my channel page, you're going to be able to see a quick link to it. All right, guys, head over there and subscribe to my channel and follow me on Facebook and Twitter. All right, with that out of the way, guys, last week, the judges decided to throw down a challenge. And the challenge they said was, we need to give you guys a story about our childhood. And so, right now, <laughs> it's kind of funny. The first thing that came to my mind was the first time I started driving. And uh, I got a 16 year old son right now, and I'm teaching him how to drive. And it's funny kind of watching him go through a lot of the same things that I went through when I was his age and uh, even younger. So, let me start this story by giving you a little background. All right, picture this eight year old DOG sitting in the back of a 1984 Chevy Chevette. We always called it the shove it because it was a pile. And uh, <laughs> my oldest sister, she was uh, 16 at that time. And so she's older than me. And so my parents were teaching her how to drive. And uh, as they taught her how to drive, I sat in the back and I was one of the little trolls back there like, ha 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 ha, you can't it again. You don't wanna get in the car seizure and stuff like that. So it was kind of funny, <laughs> but uh, so, me, little eight-year-old D.O.G., trolling it up in the back seat of the car and uh, watching my sister trying to learn how to drive in that 1984 Chevy Shove It. And uh, <laughs> my parents, they had us come up and had us also trying to learn at that same time. It was kind of funny. They said, okay, Ed, come on up. And uh, they put me up there and they let me try and shift it and try getting it going. You know, after talking so much trash sitting in the back seat, I jumped in the front seat and what do you know? I killed it just like she did. I made it look like I had seizures just like she did. And so, <laughs> that's the, the very first time that I ever drove. After that, I started driving. Uh, there was this time I took that same Chevy Chevette. I think I was about 13 years old. And uh, my parents were heading out of town. And they said, whatever you do, do not drive that car. Do not do anything with that car. Don't drive it. Don't do nothing. And uh, what did I do? I went and I drove that car. And in the back of my house, we had this field. And what I do, I drive out through the field. And a Chevy Chevette is a tiny car. And I took it out there. And I'm driving it around. Wah, 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 get some. Wah. And uh, I end up getting this thing stuck in the mud. And so my parents are coming home. I can't get this car out of the mud. It's stuck. It's buried halfway. And my dad comes home. And he is raging. And my, bat, my dad, he's a big dude like me. He's all yoked. Like, yeah, get some. And uh, <laughs> at that time, he walks up. And he is pissed. He walks up to the front of that car and he lifted it up. He grabbed the, the, the front tire and he just and he's like, throw some boards under there, rage. And I'm like, Whoa. I was like freaking out. I was like, that is like madness. My dad picked up the front of this car all by himself and he said, throw these boards under there. So when you know, when you see your dad's that pissed off, you're like, yeah, no problem, dad. I'll throw the boards under there. So <laughs> I threw the boards underneath that car. And then what he did, he jumped in there. He's like shifting, power shifting, whop, whop, whop. And he barrels that thing out of the mud, out of there. And I'm like, there, you don't even know how long I sat there and I tried lifting up the front of that car. And it wasn't until I was like 19 years old and I was like doing a lot of lifting and everything. I was finally able to lift up the front of that car. Just picked up the front fender. Yeah, get some. I felt like a beast. And... Uh, <laughs> So that was my very first times driving a car and then there was also one more incident where I got pulled over driving and I had to go through uh, Diversion got arrested all that kind of stuff and I was I think 15 at that time driving without a license a Friend of mine let me drive his car took it around did a whole bunch of stuff and uh, Just driving like normal all the time like every day and I didn't have a license or a permit or anything and uh, so they uh, 
had me do a whole bunch of community service to get through all that kind of stuff. And, uh, and fast forward now to today, I finally got my license uh, when I was 16. I still was able to do it. I was a good boy. I had to chop a bunch of wood for the 4-H in order to make sure that I was able to get my license on time. And then, so after me going through that type of stuff, learning how to drive, <laughs> Now it's my son's turn. So he's doing everything right. He's trying to learn and trying to drive. And we got nothing but stick shifts. So uh, we got a Mini Cooper. You see me hopping this little Mini Cooper. And uh, <laughs> he's getting to where that's working. But I'm, I'm feeling like the eight-year-old Yoji troll sitting in the back seat wanting to go, ha, 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 you killed it again. And uh, <laughs> But he's getting it down. And it's going. And uh, today he drove for the first time, taking the family, was in the car. He drove about 10, 15 miles home. From uh, coming back from our vacation, baby. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> all right, guys. So, that is my story of when I was a child. It was from how I got my driver's license. So, if you, if you are struggling to get your driver's license, or if you're a dad and you got a, ch a kid that you're trying to help drive, go ahead and leave a comment down in the section below. Let us know. Let us know, man. Tell us the story of your first time driving. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching and have a great day.